Hello, friends and family. This is Megan Bo, aka Tall and Lin, Me Gook Saram. And a lot of you guys have been asking me forever and ever to please do a video of my daily makeup routine. So, anyway, here it is. Let's get started. Okay, the first step, I'm taking my Urban Decay Naked Skin Foundation and I'm just putting it on sparingly because it's like a daily look. It's not too heavy, but I put a little bit too much on this side. Oh no. Anyway, so because of the lighting, I'm totally turning around to use the mirror, but whatever. You do what you gotta do. Look at my chin. Look at my chin. Look at my chin. <laughs> okay, so anyway, and then next I'm just gonna take my lip tint pack. It's like a peel off lipstick. You put it on and peel it off 15 minutes later. <laughs> And now I'm gonna take my Urban Decay Naked Skin Under Eye Concealer and I'm just gonna use it to conceal my dark circles because I did not sleep that well last night. Oh my gosh, looking like a zombie. Hello. So then I'm gonna take my Art Deco Powder and I'm just going to lightly powder my face. I don't like to put too much powder because I feel like it's kind of like eh. So just lightly powder it, you know what I mean? <laughs> I'm about to take my Mac actually it's a foundation I just took the darkest foundation they had in Korea at the Mac store and I just use it for my contour over my like powder because I don't know I like the way it looks it's just what I do and I put it on my forehead as well and then actually I take some and put it on my cheeks too like what you saw and now I'm taking my eyebrow pencil I actually like to use gray instead of using brown I don't know gray just I don't know I feel like it fits me better I've been using gray forever so I do and honestly I'm not an eyebrow expert but this is just what I do I fill it in and then I'm going to take this golden color as you can see I use it almost every day it looks horrible and I'm gonna put it on my eyelids which I failed to film and put it under my eye and now I'm gonna take this light color and just put it in the middle of my eyes to brighten it up a little bit and then I'm gonna take this light brown color from Etude House and I'm just gonna fill in my crease line and a little bit above my crease line with it I just like the way it looks and it gives my eyes some depth I feel like and I feel like it complements my eye color really well this lip stuff y'all is like it's dry now I think it's ready because it's getting on my nerves so let's just peel that off right now and look at the color it looks so like natural and it lasts a really long time sometimes you get crumblies that don't peel off though but that's okay <laughs> and now for my Sailor Moon eyeliner and I don't like to do a big thick up wing I kind of put my wing kind of down and just kind of extend it out past the line of my eye and then I flip the eyeliner on its side and just kind of draw it across to match my eye I don't do it too thick I keep it relatively thin so I'm just gonna thinly kind of line you know the outline shape of my eye and that's pretty much all I do but then I do take a brown eyeliner and just kind of line the bottom waterline a little bit only on the outer corner because I feel like it makes my eye color pop and it goes good with the gold underneath I think and then I'm just gonna take my teardrop eyeliner I got from Etude House and just lightly highlight under the eye not too thick I just kind of think it makes it look like bright and happy and lastly I'm taking my Urban Decay Perversion Mascara and I'm just putting a light mascara taking my Etude House blush and just blushing it a little bit over my cheeks and now finally for my highlighter I got from Style Nanda and I just literally highlight both of my cheeks up into the outer corner and then I highlight my chin I highlight my nose my cupid's bowl and my forehead five head sometimes I like to use this lip tint instead of using the berry someone honestly they look the same except that one's a little bit deeper but all I'm gonna do to finish the lips is just to take a lip balm I got from Labiote it's just a light pink and now we're finished so because you guys are always asking me about like the Korean products that I use and because some of you guys are wanting to buy those things but you don't know where and you don't have access to sites or you can get the products that you guys see me wearing I'm trying a new thing I'm trying a new thing if it goes well then maybe I'll do it on a monthly basis but for now we have okay it's called the Megan's K box look at this drawing one of you guys made it art of Layla she drew it for me one of you guys uh, on Instagram, Art of Layla. And so in this box for this month, the trial month, what you will have included, let me just rip it open. This is my favorite part about opening this. Okay, I was trying to make a fanfare, but I don't know if that worked. I thought, well, since it's the first month, let's just do products you guys always ask me about. So that would be, First and foremost, you will get the teardrop eye, uh, under eye teardrop liner that I really like from Etude House. And this is by far the most asked item. What is that highlighter under your eye? 
what is that highlighter? So I knew you guys would really like this one. And I like it because it's kind of flesh colored and it's not just so white. It like kind of matches with your skin a little bit. So if you apply it lightly, it just kind of gives you a little highlight without being like, bam, my eyes are highlighted. And then of course, what I'm wearing on my lips now, you guys always ask me about my lip products, be the Berry Some Lip Tint pack which you guys just saw me use a few minutes ago in the same color that I have. Very very nice like natural color in my opinion. And the other one is the other lip tint I wear all the time from the face shop. And this one I wore for a solid two years. And for like two years people were constantly asking me about the color. I still do wear this one now but it doesn't last as long as the berry some one so we thought why not put them together because this color is a lot more vibrant though. And a lot of you guys are wanting to do like the gradient lip thing. You can do it very easily with this lip color. And it smells so good. It smells and tastes really good. Another thing you asked me about are these eyelashes and number three from Etude House. They're like princess long eyelashes because I do wear them quite often. Um, not on a daily basis, but sometimes I want it like a big dolly look. So I'll wear like some circle lenses and these I think are perfect to make you look like all super dolly. And the final item that you'll get is this Claris Rich Moisturizing Mask. And the thing is like, I never really used masks until I came to Korea. And then now almost every evening, like after I wash my face and put on toner, I always slap a mask on. And this is one that I really like cause it's kind of like soothing. So for this month, the cost of this box will be 39 USD and that includes shipping to whatever you know country you're in. Because we're still a small operation, we're just opening it for half of the month at first. So from the 1st, August 1st to the 15th, um, you'll be able to buy the box. However, the supplies are limited. So if you don't get them fast enough, then there's a possibility that you won't be able to get one. However, if the demand is great enough, then we will reopen it again on the 16th to the end of the month to like be able to send some boxes out again. I hope that makes sense. So how we're doing it is we're kind of doing it based on pre-orders. So you pre-order between the 1st and the 15th and then like the 18th or so we'll ship out all the boxes. If the demand was great enough and we got a lot of extra visitors or whatever, if you just visit the page again, then we'll reopen it on the 16th to the 30th and then we'll ship out the second round of boxes on the second or third of next month. So I hope that makes sense. And anyway, I hope that you guys like this. I mean, if there are products that you saw online that you wanted me to review and possibly include in future of these like boxes, then just let me know down below. So the link will be down below if you want to go and order your Megan's K box. I really hope that you guys like and enjoy this service. If you do, then you know, just make sure you support us and who knows, maybe it could grow into something bigger. I don't know. This is just the start. I'm excited to see where it goes. So anyway, thank you guys so much for the support and love. I really appreciate you guys. You guys are fantastic. So if you like this video, like to see more videos, please subscribe to my YouTube page, which is down below. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, like me on Facebook, and I will See ya!